Welcome to today's video. Today I will show you how to set up a Performance Max campaign like a pro and how to use the feed only strategy. You may have already heard about Performance Max feed only and the reason why so many successful Google Ads managers are using the strategy, me including, is because that way you force the Google Ads algorithm to show your ads mainly as shopping ads. So no search, no display, no YouTube. And you know how it is. In 9 out of 10 times, shopping ads give you the highest return on invest investment. And that's exactly the reason why we want to force the Google Ads algorithm to show our ads mainly as shopping ads. Because we know, okay, this is how we can get the highest ROAS. And that's why we use the feed only strategy. So let me show you real quick how to do it. Actually, it's really easy to do. Just create a new campaign. Um, choose sales as your campaign objective. Purchase, of course, as your conversion goal. So you, you should have already set up your conversion tracking and and optimizing your feed as well. So you can continue with the campaign creation. Then click on Performance Max, of course, connect your feed, give it a name, let's say Pmax uh, feed only, nice. And look, now it's really simple, okay? You, we go through it, yeah, conversion value, of course, we want to optimize revenue let's say Germany, German of course, let's continue with that. So and here's the really important part, of course listing groups you can choose all products or just the best sellers, whatever you want. So I think it's loading here, yep. Okay and here it's actually really simple. What you have to do now is just not adding any assets. You don't want to include any assets. You have the final URL here, which is automatically imported from the Merchant Center URL and which doesn't really matter because we are directly linking on the product page with our feed and our products. No images. We have to delete the logo here, otherwise it will not work. No videos, no headlines, no long headlines, no descriptions. Business name is fine as well because it's imported from the Merchant Center anyways. Uh, no site links or anything like that, it doesn't really matter. You can add an audience signal, I will do that to speed up the learning phase. And that's basically it. That's how you set up a feed only campaign. So if you don't provide any assets, you force the Google Ads algorithm to mainly show your ads as Google Shopping ads and maybe even a little bit of like it. DSA retargeting stuff, but it's 99% shopping. Okay, that's how you do it. Set your budget. Let's stick to that. Review our campaign settings again, and then you're good to go. Let's finish this real quick. Publish campaign. And yeah, that's how you set up a feed only campaign. Let me know if you've tried it before and if you had any success with this type of campaign. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask. I'm happy to help and see you next time.